Since Repair Clinic encourages you to perform this repair safely, a warning icon will appear when you should use caution. To replace the water tank assembly in this GE refrigerator, you will need a Phillips head screwdriver, a quarter inch nut driver, and a 5 16 inch nut driver. Before you begin the procedure, unplug the appliance's power cord and shut off the home's water supply line valve. Have an assistant help you to move the refrigerator away from the wall. Use the quarter inch nut driver to unthread the upper center screw, securing the water line retainer and lower rear access panel. Next, unthread the five remaining screws securing the access panel using the 5 16 inch nut driver. With the screws unthreaded, lift the panel up to remove. Use the quarter inch nut driver to unthread the screw securing the water inlet valve mounting bracket. Detach the bracket from the frame. Pull out the retaining clip, then depress the lock ring to release the water tank inlet line from the valve. Be prepared for some water to spill. Unhook the water tank outlet line from the retainer. Moving to the front of the appliance, open both refrigerator doors, then use the Phillips head screwdriver to unthread the two mounting screws, securing the toe kick plate. With the screws unthreaded, pull the plate free. Unhook the water tank outlet line from the retainers, then depress the lock ring to release the line from the coupler. Next, remove the middle drawer, along with the shelf frame and glass. Remove the upper drawer as well for better access. Detach the LED light assembly cover, as well as the insulator. Using the Phillips head screwdriver, unthread the two mounting screws to release the old water tank assembly. To install the new water tank assembly, insert the longer outlet line into the left hole in the liner and the shorter inlet line into the right hole. Position the tank assembly on the rear interior panel and thread the two mounting screws. Realign the insulator. And replace the light cover. Replace the upper drawer. As well as the middle shelf frame. Set the glass in the frame. Then replace the middle drawer. You may need to return to the rear of the appliance to redirect the outlet line to the front of the refrigerator. Fully insert the outlet line into the coupler and secure the line in the retainers.
Realign the toe kick plate and rethread the screws. Returning to the rear of the appliance, secure the outlet line in the rear retainer. Fully insert the new water tank inlet line into the inlet valve port and slide in the retaining clip. Reposition the inlet valve mounting bracket on the frame and rethread the screw to secure. Replace the lower rear access panel by aligning the bottom tabs first. Rethread the screws. Secure the water line behind the retainer and rethread the upper center screw. Move the appliance back against the wall. Open the home's water supply line valve. Plug the appliance's power cord back in. And the refrigerator should be ready for use.